there's a new update for AutoWear. AutoWear is a Tasker plugin that controls your Android Wear device. First off, we have the new ADB Wi-Fi action, which allows you to run uh, any ADB command, like in Tasker, and uh, execute it with elevated privileges. For example, I have a bunch of these apps that I don't want on my Wear device, and I, with this action I can simply enable or disable an app. So in this example I want to disable this Tick Health app here. So I write health and select this app, tick health, disable it and when I run this command the app goes away. And if I want I can re-enable it with a similar command. Tick health, enable and watch this place here, this space Oops. <laughs> the app is back again. So this is the first one. You can run any ADB shell command with this and all of them will run as, uh, as it happens with the ADB Wi-Fi action in Tasker. Now the second thing I've added is the secure settings uh, helper. The automatic setup action or option and for example, let's say I want to change this option, which is the adaptive brightness option. And I don't know which, uh, which setting that corresponds to. So I just click this automatic setup action option, then change the setting on the, on the watch. Click here, click or click OK there, and it automatic, automatically detects the differences. So in this case, it's the screen brightness mode that was in, uh, disabled, set from 1 to 0. So click this, and it says the setting seems to be toggleable, and I want to toggle it, yes. And now, if I run this action, it will toggle it. So now it turned it on. If I run this action again, it'll toggle it again, turn it off. So this is the automatic setup option in secure settings. Finally, there are some of these uh, settings that are not changeable with this secure settings action. For example, there's no way to change this to not, do not disturb option <clears throat> on the watch. But now there's the new input action with the new input action, you can do stuff like you can do on your phone with auto input, and now you can do that on your watch. Let's see how it works. So for example, I can create a command which first turns on the screen. The screen is already on. Let's just let it turn off so that I can uh, show you how this works. Okay. This is taking a while. Okay, there it goes. The screen is turned off. And now if I click yes here, it turns on. And if I add more commands, I can do a swipe down and perform the action. There it goes. Now I want to add a command to click an element which is the do not disturb, so let me search for do not disturb, there it goes. And I don't want to, to click it just when it's off, I want to click it when it's on or off, so I'll set the test text to just do not disturb and perform the action. As you can see, it turned it on. And finally, I want to swipe up. And there it goes. This is the command. So now if I run this command, it'll swipe down, turn on do not disturb or toggle it, and then swipe up again. I can do this um, uh, over and over again if I want to. And this, you can use this to 
go into any menu, any setting, and click anything you want, just like you, do, you can do with auto input. So these are the three new features, major features in AutoWare. ADB Wi-Fi, the secure settings uh, setup a wizard, and the new input action. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.